welcome to its rafik today we are going to learn about scratch scratch is a programming language i think you have already learned in lower classes about scratch scratch is a block based programming language where you can just drag and drop some blocks and write some creative programs scratch is mainly used in schools to teach programming to the students to do programming using scratch you no need programming knowledge is just you need some basic knowledge about computer and or blocks then you can easily create some games animations cartoons in scratch in this lesson we will learn about pen block of scratch so first in pen block we'll get clear command clear command is used to clear the drawing or stamps whatever drawn by the sprite and we have a stamp command stamp command is used to make a temporary image of the sprite let's click on the stamp and see i have already clicked here a temporary image of the sprite but when i will click on the clear it will remove then we have pan down this block draws a line or this block draws a line as sprite move on the stage now what is a stage the background of the sprite is known as stage means the place where the sprite perform and you may ask what is a sprite the character of a scratch program is known as sprite and the background of the sprite is known as stage means now we have pen up command this block pull up the sprite pen so that it does not draw when the sprite moves suppose i don't want to draw lines now then i can use the pen up command then when the sprite sprite will move on the stage then there will be no lines but if i keep the pen down then it will draw a line when it will when it moves then set pen color to this command is used to set different pen colors here we can click on the color and we can choose some different colors set pen color to 0 this block is also used to set some pen colors here we can give some numbers to choose the color set change pen set by 10 this block changes the color of pen by a specific color or a number set pen size by 1 this block is used to change the thickness of pen to a specific number set pen set to 50 this block is used to set the thickness of pen to a specific number now let's see how we can draw a rectangle using pen tools first let's bring the sprite in middle portion clear the drawing now to draw something on the screen we will use pen down but before that we'll use that set pen color tool oh first we'll go to control block and we'll take this one when flag is clicked now we'll take move option we'll get this option in motion move 10 steps instead of 10 we'll write little big number 50 now again we'll go to pen block and we'll select set pen size 2 here it is 1 instead of 1 we'll write 5 now we'll write pen down let's see what happen it's draw a line
let's pen size is to 1 and see what it happen see earlier line was too dark or but the next line is thicker one because I have reset the sizes 1 let's clear everything now let's give the pen sizes 2 and let's click here you can see one small line let's make the steps more make it 100 now click now see the line it's little long now let's first clear everything after that we'll take turn this turn option will get in here take right turn we'll make it 90 degree 90 then again we'll do move motion move 100 instead of 10 we'll write 100 again we'll copy this part make it a duplicate oops undo make a dupl make a duplicate join it make a duplicate join it now join everything go to pen block first let's clear everything uh, go to motion turn the cat to 0 degree ok now let's click on the flag here you can see the rectangle to draw this rectangle I have written how many lines 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 lines of script if I want to reduce it then instead of this all we can use loop for that we will use control block go to control click on repeat will repeat four times here each time I will go hundred steps so instead of 10 write hundred each time I will take 90 degree turn so instead of 15 write 90 let's see now first it is the previous one clear now click on the flag here earlier the number of line was 9 now let's count 1 2 3 4 5 so the line num uh, such a big program can reduce to a small one by using loops these are called as loops in loops we can use two types forever and repeat in repeat we will write how many numbers of time we want to repeat the steps in forever if I want to repeat some step forever means it will never stop it will go on till the user click on stop button that for that purpose we can use forever and if we know the number of steps like for a rectangle we need four steps then we will use repeat 10 times now let's draw a triangle by using repeat only first I will write here instead of 4 3 then move 100 only and here how I will know how much degree I have to turn for that 360 divided by 3 why 360 because uh, 
when you uh, it will be 120 go to pen first clear bring the sprite here now click on flake see it's drawn a triangle now suppose I need a pentagon so in place of repeat I will write 5 step will be 100 only now degree how much for that what I will do 360 divide by 5 how much it will be Three sixty divided by five. It will be seventy two. First, clear the previous drawing. Bring the sprite here and click on the flag. Oh, the pentagon went to up. Let's clear it. Again, click on the flag. Here you can see a pentagon. Like same way for hexagon, we will write the number of step as 6. And turn, it will be how much? How will know? 360 divided by 6 because pentagon have 6 sides. It will be 60 only. First let's clear the previous drawing. Click on green flag here it's a hexagon so like these drawings we can create or do by using loops mainly two loops you will get here repeat and forever thank you for watching have a nice day